So, as I said that I wanted to save the second floor for later, I am loath to continue doing anything else up here. A light switch? Neat. My guard saw nothing. Let's head back out to the training room. I'm gonna keep the rope arrow here. Uh, this this may be of use to me in the future. I've got several other rope arrows, my one waist notwithstanding. I'm so visible right now. Any supplies or goodies back here? Doesn't look like it. Rope arrow, uh, water arrows are nice, excuse me. Do, 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 do. Who? Well, that's ugly. Oh, that's so ugly, all that light out there. <sighs> I'm gonna have to wait. Or I take him out. Let's wait. Why don't we treat this as, uh... I'll take out someone if I have to. But I like the idea of playing this mission ghost-like. Alright, let everyone go about their patrols. No fuss. The rope arrow, leaving that behind, seems a tad suspicious, but what can you do? I guess not leave it there, huh? visible here, too. Two guards manning the guard post there, but it doesn't look like they'll turn around for anything. He's not walking away from me. He's walking towards me. Hopefully no one walks along these sides, yeah? Looks like a courtyard area. Probably where the well is. Nice. We can leave that courtyard for later. Ah, hell. Let's go explore it now. guards out here? In the mess hall now. Lights. <laughs> wow. Wow. I'm glad I was back there. I was thinking about those bright lights. Those are gas lamps I can put them out, but these lights are not ones I can extinguish. It's good that I ducked back here. Attention, the Mechanist Brother Artis has informed me that the new security measures will be fully operational tonight. A room in the records hall has been designated for secure records. Only the lieutenants and myself have access. The City Watch Ball will be held at Shored Estate. All members of the City Watch are encouraged to attend. 
The dumb waiter in the mess hall is not a toy. Please refrain from using it for rides. Sheriff Gorman Truart. There's gonna be a ball held at his estate. It's good information to have, I guess. Might come in handy. Maybe we'll do a job at the Truart estate at some point. Now, is there anything of worth back here? Food. I'm gonna go ahead and put these out. This dumb waiter. <laughs> okay, that's where that puts me. If I took this as a ride. Let's get a look at the situation up here. Bright as hell. Yeah, this is the lounge. Okay. <sighs> when that walking goes away... Let's tag that. Grab some quick loot. Note that, uh, looting is not an objective for us on this heist. I have some suspicion involving that. But I guess, uh, story line-wise, Garrett is being, in, like, offered a huge sum of money to do this job. Or, I don't know how much money he actually is, other than a considerable sum to make him, like, forget his misgivings. And, uh... God, I forgot my... I lost my train of thought there when I heard that door open. Oh, yeah. So, um... Like, stealing stuff around can be a cause for suspicion. You know, storyline-wise. Kayfabe. You know, all these missing items uh, would make it harder for our frame job. Could possibly use a rope arrow to, like, climb up that ledge. And you could start with rope arrows. That makes sense. I didn't even check the sea guard position. Okay. Let's go back to the location where I was go through things in an orderly fashion. This is the barracks. Please to relieve yourself and wash your hands afterwards. the worst happen, we'll have that. A wonderful tool. Though I have repeatedly blinded myself with it in this game. <laughs> A tragedy. I should be able to find something in here. Never, never quick enough to look away from it. Alright, a noisemaker arrow. Healing potion. Nothing else. Over here we have another healing potion. An invisibility potion. I've got four invisibility potions. Good heavens. Three flash bombs. 
feel like I could be far more reckless with all these, uh, all these resources. Who's making that noise? That wall looks odd. Back here. Anything? A flash bomb. Interesting trinket to stick back there, but okay. Such is life. We saw this uh, during the intro cinematic. This is the main office. Okay. That operates that. Kick me. <sighs> Lucy Walker. The watch officers have received a number of complaints about your harassment of the alchemist, Grimmed. Out, out of consideration for your masters, you have not been placed under arrest yet. Please keep in mind that any further trouble may result in arrest and confiscation of property. For a safe city, watch Officer Morgan. Harassment, huh? Got a nice amount of loot here. Burglary. E Park Boulevard, burglary of carriage, horses taken, blah, 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 blah. Doesn't look like any secret switch over on this side. Paganism. Assault. Harboring a pagan. Pagan sympathy. Oof. Dagger display. for me? You know you want to crouch? I hate you so much, Gary. Like, I don't, I don't enjoy the fact that he's stuck here and is not... Fucking shit! What you're doing is making noise, Garrett! Stop it! will it take for you to go through there, Garrett? Like, I'm, I'm, like, trying to jump to, like, probably, like, get him through there, but that's not doing anything for him. Other than making him bounce off. I, may, I might have to move the rope arrow. This is gonna get me caught. Okay. Well, we put it here, Garrett. Platforming in this game is, uh, rough. Okay, we're in the records hall. We've bypassed, uh, using this stairwell. That has a guard post and alarm. I believe I've deactivated the alarm. Secure records. Uh, yeah, that's not a surprise. Anything in here for us? Doesn't look like it.
several torches. I want to get a look at how the situation up here is down here. And hopefully no one opens this door. Besides me. But I don't have a key to. Rest in peace is Water Arrow. Okay. This leads down to the basement. Which is uh, where we saw the jail and the morgue and the like. Yeah, right there. Doesn't look like there's anyone guarding this, though. That's an alarm button. He's got a key. Maybe I can use that key up here. I mean, it makes sense that he wouldn't have the damn key, but, uh, thought I'd try, right? At least we have it. Key may have... well, whatever. It doesn't matter. If we come across any doors we can't open, we'll try it, though. Courtyard, of course. Main office over here. Now, there was a... a thing over here that I wanted to check out. Looks like a lounge. Okay, we've almost explored the... Lineup area. Neat. He made a comment about the torch. We'll uh, we'll check out the armory and target range after he turns around again, and we'll walk past. I like that this game is easy to alt-tab from. Quickly boots up. No glitches in the interface or anything. Uh, our key work here? If I can cycle to it? No, it doesn't. Um, shooting range? Okay, that opens. Guess I could use some target practice. Anything out here for us? <laughs> I wasn't even trying to, like, I was trying to grab the arrow. Neat. Guess that takes us into the armory. Moss arrows, invisibility potion. Outing orb, noisemaker arrow, lots of good stuff. Good stuff.
Okay, that takes care of the entire first floor, then, I guess, besides that. Um, we should head to the second floor now. Uh, I think I'll go back to the training room. And uh, use the the access to the sheriff's office through the sheriff's office. Looks like it's nothing. <sighs> Someone say something. No. I guess it's nothing now. Come out where I can see you. Figured I'd try and save us some time there. Let's see if the training room was at that point. Okay. Alternatively, I could try my idea. Nice game design, giving you multiple avenues to, uh, pursue objectives. So that puts us up here. Guard standing right there, huh? I guess that is a guard post with an alarm. There's a guy behind him, basically. They're just, like, watching the way there. Shit! 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 The moment I let that arrow go, I was like... What if someone turns that corner? Not only do I miss the lamp, but someone turns the corner. back here? Yes. So this is a section and basically you head down to the first floor that way. Not entirely sure what this like part of the map is all about. Might have missed something. Oh well. Waiting room. At least there's only the one guard to worry about. Plus the two watching each other from across the way. I'm gonna wait until this guy heads back down that hallway, and then I'm gonna make my move. Didn't realize he'd come all the way back here. That's awkward. In storage, will my key work on this? Yes. And this will take us up to where evidence is stored here, but we need to uh, get a key to the vault in one of the lieutenant's offices first before we go all the way in there. Alright, we're in vice now. We are still unable to make a case against Madame Valari. Her brothel seems to be perfectly legitimate, but Lieutenant Mosley believes that there is more going on there, and so do I. The likely possibility is that they are using pillow talk to extract information from their rather aristocratic clientele. 
I can't believe I am saying this in a journal, but I think that the sheriff is somehow involved in this. I have seen Chuart enter there on more than one occasion. But is he a client, or is he somehow working with them? All I know is that I am not going to say a word about this to anyone, especially Lieutenant Hagen. Mosley is the only one any of us can trust. Hmm. That is certainly one hell of a thing to write in a journal. <laughs> you might as well have written Hail the Trickster. Side. Anything in the trash here? No, just a book. Work's been pretty slow these days. Between Mosley and Warden Affairs, every thief in the city is out of business. I can't believe we used to try to stop crime by arresting the thieves. By attacking the bookkeepers and fences, crooks have nowhere to turn to. Besides, who is more anxious about staying out of jail? A criminal or some whiny pencil pusher? So the way they've been able to sharply... Could we check that out? Reduce crime. Okay, okay. Get a hold of yourself, officer. Thing there. Is not by uh, targeting criminals directly, but by targeting them indirectly, which has worked out very well for them. That noise? Lieutenant Mosley, I put you in charge of handling the Pagans because you are my second-in-command. Until now, your record has been exemplary. I don't understand why your performance has faltered. If you do not want this case to be reassigned to Lieutenant Hagen, I suggest you double your efforts to rid the city of all Pagan influence. That's, that's one hell of an order. <laughs> Fuck it. <laughs> Delete Paganism from the city. The hell? Not an Inquisitor. <laughs> Also, it has been brought to my attention that numerous small thefts from the evidence vault have been occurring for some time now. Fire the officer that guards the vault. The sentries can handle the security by themselves. I want you to conduct an investigation immediately. Be it so ordered, Sheriff Gorman Truard. Mmm. So they're relying per like just on the mechanical sentries then, by the looks of things, for the vault. Which is good for us. There might be something else in this room, but I want to deal with the, uh... The gas lamp. <clears throat> oh, hello. Looks like there's someone who's watching that side. What? Two moss arrows and a water arrow. Journal entry 2234. It's getting harder to protect my garden from harm. So many plants die. No matter how hard I try to protect them, they still fall victim to the elements. No matter what anyone tells me, I will not uproot them or cut them down. I don't know what we are doing here anymore. Half the people I give orders to are people I arrested before. Hopefully the war will be over soon and the Baron will return. I don't think I can take much more of Chewart's new age. As Hagen so often puts it. So, many of the criminal elements, the thugs and the ruffians uh, that have been arrested, uh, have been impressed into the city watch. It, uh, it's a play on the theme. Uh, it's, it's not new. Uh, the, the idea that the um, law enforcement itself is a gang. Uh, little different from any other, like, bands of scoundrels only they have official backing and support, and that can make them meaner. Yeah, that's a that's a theme that's uh, pursued in uh, John Harper's Blades in the Dark too. The Blue Coats being a powerful tier like gang, you know, full of corruption and uh, power. Okay, this was interesting. We're gonna wait now, though. And then we'll shoot across to Lieutenant Hagen's office. Lieutenant
Lieutenant Mosley seems disillusioned with events. <clears throat> Let's see what I can use against our Lieutenant Hagen. Hagen, instead of Hagen does. Got it. Lieutenant Hagen, I appreciate your memo regarding the Warden Affairs Division. I personally investigated the matter and have found no evidence to support your accusation. They have ongoing investigations on the remaining Wardens and have made steady progress. They simply don't have enough of a case yet to move against them. Hmm. As for the missing evidence, my search has determined that they were simply clerical errors. However, I have discovered that several thefts from the Vault have recently occurred. These thefts are in no way linked to the Warden Affairs Division. I want you to find out who is responsible. Note that uh, the Sheriff also directed Lieutenant Mosley to look into this as well. Start making inquiries into the other divisions, but stay away from Warden Affairs. Also discuss this with no one, especially Lieutenant Mosley. Mosley's inability to handle the Pagans has caused me to question her resolve. I've considered handing over the assignment to you, but given Lieutenant Mosley's excellent past record, I want to give her one more chance. Be it so ordered, Sheriff Gorman Truert. 